Some of the voices from Occupy Wall Street protesters here in New York as they march to Times Square in a global day of demonstrations backing their month-long campaign against economic inequality. For more about the events in New York, we're joined by Ryan Devereaux, Democracy Now! reporter who's been closely following Occupy Wall Street. Um, Ryan, uh, we were together at 46th Street and Times Square. Um, it was a scene of tremendous tension through the evening that shifted. Talk about the police on horseback. Well, we were located at a sort of flashpoint in the confrontation between the protesters and the police at Times Square. There was a barricade line in front of us that prevented the demonstrators from entering into the main strip that most people would recognize as Times Square. Um, this was hundreds and hundreds of people backed up at this point. The police were just attempting. Just in that area, there were thousands just, of just people. Just in that in Times area Square. alone, thousands were. You're correct. Thousands were in the area of Times Square, but in that intersection where we were, hundreds and hundreds of people were backed up as far as you could see. The police were attempting to push that barricade line back into the crowd. Some officers physically picked up the medical metal barricades and used them as shields, pushing back into the crowd. Um, tensions reached a boiling point when the barricades were opened and the police uh, allowed officers on horseback to enter into the crowded space. Admittedly, some people chose to stand their ground, as the NYPD repeatedly told them to back off, but those who who wanted to move really couldn't. There was no space to get away, and these horses were pushed into the crowd. I, I witnessed one officer actually spurring his horse into the people. Um, demonstrators were terrified. They were screaming. One, one young woman next to me was saying over and over again, you're going to kill somebody. At one point, one of the horses went down, and it was it was near pandemonium. People people couldn't believe. And I, I couldn't believe. The horse believe. went down on its knees. Yes, that's correct. The, Almost as if it didn't want to charge the crowd. It, the horses actually did seem resistant to being pushed into this massive crowd of people. I mean, it was bright lights, loud noises, and nowhere for the people to go. I saw one young woman whose nose was literally up against the chest of a horse.